I'm going to combine rule number six and rule number seven together. Rule number six is create a virtual relationship. And rule number seven is take giant leaps. I'm old enough to remember the day that Amazon came into being. I'm also a booker. In the last five years, I can count on one hand the number of books that I've bought in bookstores. The bookstores are dinosaurs today. And it's all because Amazon got there first. Amazon built speed of access, ease of access. It's not just books that Amazon sells. Amazon now is the highest market cap retailer in the world. People don't shop the way they did 10 years ago. Today, everything is about, I'm in the mood to buy, and they turn on their laptop. If you talk to Jeff Bezos and Amazon, he talks about a customer-obsessed culture, and he has a strategy, which is profits last. What he tries to do is penetrate a category, nurture the customers, earn their respect in their business, get them to generate a range of new customers in that category, and tell his story. And at the very last minute, he raises prices, and he makes a lot of money. It's a category-by-category category conquest strategy. It started in books, and it's now moved from books to music to appliances to food to household products. It's everything you buy. You better speed up your virtual relationship because that's where your customers are going. Rule number seven is take giant leaps. The Brazilian rainforest is one of nature's greatest assets. It has the greatest biodiversity in the world. There's a relatively small company in Brazil called Natura. These are Natura's products. One of them is called Mama e Bebe, and the other one is the Ecos product line. They both share two things in common. The primary ingredients are sourced from the Brazilian rainforest. It's three founders deciding that they're going to change the world. And they're going to change the world with the product, and they're going to change the world with distribution. They went to the Brazilian rainforest to find product that was natural and pure. Their second major invention was to sell through an own proprietary distribution system to find 1.5 million Brazilian women who could use Natura as a step out of poverty. So the major lesson from Natura is to take a giant leap and to invent a new business system on several dimensions at once. The giant leap is the products have technical, functional, emotional benefits. And what they're doing is applying rule number seven. Men's grooming, wine, toys. Maybe I'll buy rockets. Make your dreams for your brand come true. Read Rocket, eight lessons to secure infinite growth.